Hello and welcome to another Python tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to be talking about how to manipulate actual files. So how do we delete, rename, and move files and even directories. So with that let's get into it. Let's make a fake directory here and we'll just call this um, whole folder. And within whole folder we're going to make just some random stuff. Another folder and then we're going to have a um, Let's do an image, and then we'll just make an extra text document here. Okay, so now we have stuff within this whole folder. So the next thing we want to do is delete stuff. Like, let's delete something from that folder. So the first things that we're going to need, we're going to have to import two fun or two uh, imports, and the first one is going to be glob for global, and then import os. Now the next thing we want to do is specify the directory uh, that this stuff is located in. Now you can shorten the directories. For example, we're file delete. You can just say whole folder, right? So we could say whole folder. Oh my goodness, can't type. And then use forward slashes. I think you can use backslashes as long as you use two. I want to say, but just use a forward slash. It makes navigating a lot easier. So then within whole folder. Let's say uh, we want to go ahead and delete this text document. So let me just make a copy of it, and we're going to delete this one. So um, so we'll say that's our directory, whole folder. Now the next thing we want to do is say os.chdir. We want to change directory into that directory. Subsequently, we want to specify the files that we want to delete, so that will be global.glob, and then anything in that directory ending with txt, let's get in the axe. For file name in files, we want to do os unlink file name. Unlink is short for dominated. So, uh, let's go ahead and run this. Pop this over here. And we see it actually deleted both of our uh, text documents because we said to delete everything that was text but everything else is still intact so we didn't delete everything just the text files so now I know you know what everybody wants to know is how do we delete the entire directory you know do some serious destruction so um, if you you might be thinking you could just maybe delete all from a whole folder but if you do that let me show you what ends up happening you get access denied. We, we don't have access to do that because this isn't like a valid Windows program. I think you could go into your user account settings and just take away the requirement for access. So it's kind of like whenever you download like a third party program and you go to run it and Windows is like, are you sure? You know, um, that's not happening here. Instead, we're just trying to go ahead and go through it and not ask for access and it's getting denied. So you could go through and remove that or you could actually delete uh, whole directories this way. So I'm going to show you guys the way to delete directories properly without making yourself super vulnerable. Plus, it's going to take a lot less code. Now, when you do this, before we kind of used shorthand, we just said, okay, the folder, because this is our file was uh, located right here. But let's um, let's use it. We're going to use a different function, and we're going to type out the entire thing just due to the nature of, of this uh, function here. So we're going to import shutil. And from shutil, uh, we want to get remove tree. So this is going to remove the entire tree. So the tree that we want to remove, we're going to give the entire location because it's going to remove a tree and you're not really, I mean, you're kind of specifying the name, but it's just good to go ahead and type out the entire thing whenever you're deleting files, especially whole folders, really. So this is going to be users h uh, desktop, and we're gonna, we're hiding over here in syntax lessons in the file manip folder, and we want to go ahead and delete the entire whole folder. And that's it. It's a one-line function basically. So you hit it, you go goodbye whole folder. It is now gone. 
So that's pretty much it with deleting directories and files. In the next tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to rename and to move files. So kind of like deleting and, um, well, deleting, it, besides from the uh, directory, it was kind of different functions. But deleting is pretty much the same overall. And then also renaming and moving is kind of the same thing. So with that, uh, hopefully that's helping some of you guys. Stay tuned to the next video. As always, thanks for watching.